In okay. order to donate blood, you have to be 16 years old gotcha. uh, with parental permission. Mm -hmm. Now, some schools will allow them to donate without parental permission if they're 17. Sure. If you're 17, our rules are if you're 17 and above, you can donate. Yeah, yeah. Um, some of our high schools, and education takes up about 30% of our blood supply right now. Right. Um, some schools still require, if you're attending school, you have to have your parental permission. And I get that. And yeah. that's, that's great. Um, and our schools are amazing. And, and the irony is this young man went to UConn High School. And that's one of my accounts. Yeah. I mean, it's just this weird kind of God thing where, where not only did he donate blood to save my life, but he went to school at one of the schools that I handle. Yeah. So, I mean, it, it's been a wild experience. And we, we are seeing right now, we need those young people. Mm -hmm. We need those first-time donors to experience it. Because sadly, right now, we have a lot of donor apathy. Um, coming out of COVID, mm -hmm. those types of situations, people have kind of gotten into their own box. And thankful, thankfully, we have people like you spreading the message and getting out there and getting in people's faces, as it were, mm -hmm. to talk about you know, this isn't just an abstract idea. Right. It's not like going to the Goodwill and taking clothes, so, you know, which is the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do to donate blood, but it has an impact literally to save lives. And I happen to be an example of that. Yeah. Is there like a, like a maximum age? Nope. No? Uh, no, not at all. Yeah. I have a, a, a gentleman who comes to one of my drives and I think he's been donating for almost 50 years. Yeah. And I think he's in his 80s. But what's funny about this guy, he's, he's the typical get off my lawn kind of guy, right? So he, he has a thing about nutter butters. Okay. He loves them. And he'll come to my drive and he doesn't even bother to check in. He just walks right over to the snack table. And if I don't have nutter butters, he'll leave. <laughs> So, for my for my drugs, I make sure that we have nutter butters. So, gotta have those cookies. So yeah. there is no age limit. People can be 80, 90 years old. The only restrictions are some travel restrictions, some medication. For example, myself being a transplant patient, mm. uh, I take anti-rejection medication, and I can't donate because of that. Right. Some heart medication, for example, uh, some arthritis medication, but generally. Those are the only really re restrictions.